Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Guess where I am today? This is a very, very beautiful building. This is um, the Superman Court. Believe it or not, this is a court and this is uh, free to visit. Um, it's in a perfect location, just that's the Big Ben behind me and the other side, the Big Ben is this place. Listen, if you need a toilet, <laughs> you can come here and use a free toilet. Uh, and if, if you're not a solicitor and you're not really bothered about the UK you know, legal system, it's still a good place to visit just because of the beautiful building. And if you're interested in you know, the uh, UK's law system and what's inside, you can just do a very quick tour. Uh, there are three courtrooms you can have a look and learn a little bit about the UK laws um, and there is a really quiet cafe if you you can start seeing you're really tired you can sit down and enjoy your coffee okay so let's go inside and have a look okay so now we are in courtroom one this is the largest courtroom and is located on second floor so basically, this building itself dates back to um, 1913 until 1965. Middlesex County Council used the building for their administration and for council meetings. Many of the original features from um, Middlesex days remain on display throughout the building such as the beautiful stained glass windows, the wood carvings, and much of the stonework. This courtroom one was where the council meetings took place, and the wood carvings on the benches in this room are particularly fine. Much of the artwork in the building was also owned originally by Middlesex County Council, and now forms the Middlesex Art Collection. During 1980s, the building became a crown court, and in 2009, the building was chosen to be the home for Supreme Court. When you have a walk around in this building, you probably notice that these courtrooms look and feel quite different to a typical courtroom. For example, there is no dog or witness stand. This is because this court does not hold trials where guilt or innocent are decided. Instead, points of law are discussed, so the courtrooms are specially designed to in in encourage an uh. atmosphere of learned debate. It could be something quite big or something quite small. It could be something like what's happening in Parliament. Oh, it could be something quite small, um, like a debate about a dad taking his child to Disneyland. Um, yeah, so it could be small or, or it could be big. And if there is a case taking place at the time when you visit the court, uh, you're welcome to watch some or all of it um, if you want to. Just you need to sit at back and turn your phone off and try to be quiet. Okay, now we are on the lower ground floor. You can see this very beautiful robe on display in the exhibition area. You will notice that either the lawyers nor justice wear normal court dress, such as wigs and gowns in this court. The justice do have ceremony gowns to wear on special occasions such as the opening of the legal year, but during hearings they just wear normal business clothes. So court room 2, you can see this room is very mo uh, modern. So there are three court rooms uh, in this court. Each has their own unique architecture and identity. From the building, you can admire the beautiful stained glass windows 
and the immense collection of art, including the pop art style carpet. The carpet has four plants to represent the four countries that use this carpet.、Uh, use this carpet. The cases will usually have been through several courts before coming to this court. The court plays a very important role in interpretation and development of the law, making decisions that are relevant to everyday lives and that can help shape our society.、Um, okay, that's pretty much everything、uh, I want to show you、um, here today. And is I personally think is a very interesting place to visit. It's free,、um, and it got toilets. You can use the toilets when you're in this very busy, you know,、uh, Parliament and Big Ben area. And they also got a lovely cafe downstairs for you to have a break and have some coffee and pudding. Okay, I hope you enjoy today's video. And this place is just the other side of Big Ben.、Uh, this is Westminster Abbey there. So、um, I'm sure if you are in central London, you walk past a lot here. And、um, yeah, go downstairs and grab a coffee. It's very quiet. Oh, use the toilet and check this beautiful building out. Okay, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I'll see you next time. Bye.